Hi, I'm Charlotte and this is Purdy. This is Anna, our chemist. We're going to have a chat now about some of the potential downsides of using some quite harsh cleaning chemicals. So we've heard a lot of stuff about how perhaps we should be turning away from things like bleach for every day and perhaps some other quite harsh chemicals. What would you say about that? So there are some studies sort of scientifically validated that do link a frequent use of bleach or harsh cleaning products to certain health conditions such as asthma or allergies or even infections. So Anna, do we need to use antibacterial products in our day-to-day -day materials that we use to clean our home? In, in our day-to-day -day life, mm. not, not really, no. So the antibacterial products, they actually they do kill bacteria on our surfaces but they do not clean them. Mm -hmm. So there is a place for these, such as in healthcare, mm -hmm. but in our homes they're not really needed. So is it a bad thing, killing bacteria? In certain cases it can be. So for example, if we do destroy our gut or skin microbiome, we can um, you know, get into some problems. Um, what is also quite concerning is overuse of these um, chemicals that you know, kill majority of bacteria is actually they can develop antibiotic resistance. Smell is one of the most primitive and powerful of our senses and in these times that we've been through I think we all could do something a little restorative. Um, Charlotte and I have spent a great deal of time coming up with our frankincense and myrrh Christmas blend. We wanted to create um, a smell that um, didn't have cloves and cinnamon in it and it was rather fresh um, but took one's back to one's childhood of, you know, the lovely Christmases we used to have. And so we hope you enjoy it as much as we do.